Hello and welcome back to the space rave. <laughs> I still can't get over the fact that this is like essentially club music. I love it. Let's get let's see how much of the base we can get through this part. Oh yes, these rooms. Let's see here. Do I remember? I'm not I don't have the stupid, right? Yeah, we're good. Elevator key. The floor deactivates. Yep. You know, Ooh, yay, Ultra Shroom. It's so funny. I remember on the entire playthrough, I've been saying that this game looks very shiny. Well, out of all the places that are shiny, this has to be the shiniest place. <laughs> oh my god. Because, you know, it's made out of metal and everything, so like, like, what did you expect? Ah, yes, the crane game with the feeling fine and feeling fine partner, which aren't really that great, but we need a cog. Save block. Was that safe block always there? You know, at this point, I think I've gone see now. Oh, look, a new enemy. Am I might get to kill him with this hammer? No, okay, we're good. An X not PhD. Were they always called an X not PhD? I do not remember. I thought they were just X not scientists or lab assistants or something. Nan HP, four attack, no defense, beaker of chemicals. They do all sorts of stuff. So it's basically just an advanced X not, but without like the combat prowess. Yeah. Ah, yes, another one. But this time, the. The solution is on the wall. Okay. Right, I'm up here. Then it's one. Is it just one? You stupid. What the? Oh yeah, well I'm glad the sleepy sheep is still here. I think I was just as befuddled in the original playthrough that there was a sleepy sheep. <laughs> it's so weird. Oh, the teleporter room. Yes. So this leads back to Rogueport. I'm not going to show it off because reasons. <laughs> I'm trying to keep these parts nice and concise without too much fluff. Oh, these bitches. What's funny though is, I don't know if my phone's listening to me or not, but long story short, I've been seeing a lot of uh, content being shown on YouTube and stuff that is in regards to like Paper Mario stuff. And what I've noticed is this is one guy who does like Paper Mario Thousand Year Door speed runs or um, what else? Like challenge runs. And he did like a tier list for badges and stuff. I remember he put like the damage dodge stuff in like bottom tier. He even put damage dodge partner on like F tier. And his ex and his reasoning was, oh, just get good at super guards. They're not that hard. I'm like, you put thousands of hours into this game because you love it with all your heart and you make a lot of content out of it. You can't expect a casual player to be able to perfect a three frame input when they're probably going to play this game just like once. Ooh, look, a star piece. I don't know. Like, like most of his tier list was fine. And then he was like, like his tier list basically reflected how he played. And that was just like a very large bias. I do. I wasn't like mad, mad at the um, tier list or anything like that because to each their own. But like to see one of my favorite badges that put in all the work just be put into F tier by a guy because he's like, yeah, just get good, pleb. I'm just like, no, no, that's not how that works, Jagoff. You let people play the game in their own way. Oh, is this Easter egg still here? <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, no, hold on. I got to see if the partners are here. Yeah, they are. They're all pixels. That is amazing. At least I guess the open stuff, too. That is awesome. How to turn on the power. Left, right, middle. Do not forget. That makes sense. Oh, crap. And then, what does this one say? Today's... Oh, God, yes. Fucking codes. I'm taking a picture. <laughs> I'm not remembering that. I'm an old-ass man who can't even... I'm lucky I remember my name. Alrighty. Well, at least I got the important information that I needed. Oh, hell no. Ugh. What do I do? They all have way too much health. You know what? Let's try something. This probably won't work very well for me. If it doesn't, I'm running. <laughs> but I'm gonna do this for the culture. I'm probably bad at this now, though. I used to be so much faster. And then, like this. Okay, never mind. I did it. Kill him. Kill him good. Yeah! Woo! 30? What? 32? Holy crap, I am under leveled. I just realized I'm supposed to be on the next state tier list of like the stages. Like this is the middle tier and then there's one more tier after this, I think. And like, what the hell? Anyway, um, badge power? Badge power, no, 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 no. I need flower power. 
My health is fine. I just have to get good and not take as much damage. I'm not gonna up my health too, too much, but that flower power does need to be a little higher. So I got the code. I know the sequence. Now for this jackass. The thing is, I have to let him live at least one turn because I have to title the mini thing that he puts out too. That's an X Yux. I heard it's read as cross Yux, not as X Yes. X Yes. Anyway, this is a new Yux designed to put extra important areas. They were designed to be unbeatable. They're not. Yeah, they only have one defense, 10 HP, and three attacks, but they put up two mini ones and can immobilize things. Yeah, so I could kill it right now. I'm not going to. Wait, what am I doing? I have to tattle the stupid thing. Well, I'm about to take a crap ton of damage. Yeah, mini X Yux, it just protects the Yux. No need for any further explanation. Oh boy, time for the pain train. Oh Lord, have mercy. So I have no choice but to spend double the amount of flower power. Unless I use flower power? Yeah, give me. Let's let, let's show off let's uh show off art attack. Let's show off art attack. I haven't showed it off in this game. I wonder how it feels like. Oh my god, the sensitivity. Well, there's no point in continuing because he still has that barrier. The Crystal Star now looks like something that came straight out of Mario Paint. <laughs> Alright, now it's dead. Alright, that's my own damn fault, but whatever. I'll get my star power back. Aha! I knew something was here. Another security card. We need... I think I picked up t only two of them. I think I need one more. Because there's two bypass for security for a particular floor. But wait, I think I still need an elevator key, an additional elevator key, because the elevator only goes to the first two sub-levels. We're about to find out, though. Well, I do got this cog. And now to activate it, it's left, right, middle. And then that should let a panel pop up, I think? And now we play the crane game. You want to learn how to waste time? This is how you do it. The crane will move left for as long as you hold down Y. Then the crane will move backwards for as long as you hold down X. Use the crane well to get the stuff you want. Wasn't it A? Let's get that star piece first. Woo. This reminds me of, um... This, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of watching Ray playing the Yakuza series. Oh, wait, I can just keep going now instead of having to always interact with it. Sweet. Uh-oh. That's probably not going to pick it up. Uh-oh, boy. Nope. <laughs> no jank. But yeah, it reminds me of Ray playing the Yakuza series because he would love the crane game. <laughs> Mario just going, huh? <laughs> I find that to be hilarious. Okay, now I got it. But yeah, that's what it reminds me of. I I don't think he's played in the, the Yakuza series or Yakuza series. I don't know how to pronounce anything. Okay, leave me alone. I don't want any of the coins. I particularly couldn't care less. It's only one coin. Oh boy. Is that, is that a get? No. Oh, bruh. I still can't I still can't get over the fact that Mario just shrugs. He's like, what do you want me to do about it? Uh oh. Not again. Bruh. There we go, finally. Okay, give me my badges. And my star piece. Oh boy. Okay. Now that we're done screwing around. Please enter the access code. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. I took a picture. Damn it. Where's my picture? <laughs> so it is. Zero one four zero two nine. Wait, yeah, zero two nine. There we go. God, I'm dumb. <laughs> I couldn't even read. Oh yeah, this guy. I forgot about you. Hi. Who are you, huh? You came here to get the elevator key so you can access the computer room. Yeah, I thought so. Well, then you have to beat me to get it. And if you lose, your life is mine. You hear me? Mine. So what do you say? Challenge is chump. Mmm, -hmm, you're mine now. It's time for another game show host, this time hosted by Metal Thwomp. The main event, the 66 Trivia Quiz Off. You win, but if you get three wrong, you're toast. You don't want to be toast. Here we go. Question number one. Exactly what's hidden here? A monkey. The elevator key. Elevator key. You sure? Yes. God damn. You're correct. Crud. Yeah, yeah. It's the same thing as when we were at Hooktail Castle. I'm just glad that they did this repetitively. What's the name of the girl in Petalburg who's waiting patiently for Koops to return? Yeah, that would be Koopy Koo. No, it actually is Flavio. You're correct. Here we go, sucker. Question number three. 
Goombella, Lava, Goomba, Lava Bubble, Buzzy Beetle, and Boo. How many feet do they have total? Oh, great. So Boo's and, Boo's and Lava Bubbles don't have any feet. Beetles have four, and Goombas have two, so six. Yeah. Unless I'm getting friggin' destroyed. We were screwed. God, it reminds me of the Legends Arceus, t the time I was playing Legends Arceus, and I couldn't count eyes. It's elementary for non-idiots. Where is the one, where was the one and only diamond star? Uh, that would be Hooktail's belly. It's the first crystal star. It only makes sense. You're correct, you jerk. You already gotten four? You're kidding me. Well, fine. I'm gonna toss an extra hard one your way. Yeah, yeah. Question five. What was the name of the very first champion? Well, that'd be Prince Mush. Prince Matthew. <laughs> Prince Mush. Because, you know, he's a mushroom. He's a toad. Because <laughs> the facial expressions always get me. Woohoo! Ooh, okay, correct. That's five correct answers. Crud, you win. Nice. I, I love the extra flare. Now give me that damn elevator key. I lose. Fine, but I really hate you. Take this, you bum. <laughs> and there he goes. All right, perfect. Got the other elevator key. Now we can keep going. Okay, so now we have sub level three and four. If I recall correctly, four, there isn't really much. So I think the only thing I got left to do is on three. Why is it so dark? Four is supposed to be dark, not this one. Ah, yes, this one. You have to follow the path. It really is simple, but I'm bad. So watch me get zapped a few times. Possibly. Maybe? Who knows? You know, I'm waiting for the Nintendo Direct to come out. They said there was one coming out in the middle of the year. And the reason why was because they were just gonna, you know, announce new games and stuff like that, because it is about time. But they did say they will be announcing a brand new Switch uh, near the end of the year. And that's great and all, because the Switch has been alive for a very long time, and we are due for an upgrade. But at the same time, I just hope it's compatible with Switch games. Oh, Gumbella got screwed. <laughs> Twice. Okay, that should be the last security key. That should be. Emphasis on should be. I have no idea. Let's see what this item is. Ah, an HP drain. But yeah, I'm super excited for the new Switch or whatever it's going to be. I just hope for backwards compatibility. If they don't do backwards compatibility, I'm going to be upset. Ah, yes. Wait, I think I am. Am I missing? Hold on. I'm missing one. I need four. So that means maybe there is something at the bottom floor. Hold on. I'm not remembering this game right. All right. Well, this is Peach's room. Aw, they took out the Peach music when you're in her room. What the hell? Oh my god, they added a cutscene for it. What the fuck? <laughs> so, so in the original game, if you came into this room, there absolutely is an x naught in the shower. But he's just kind of sitting in the tub and then you just, you know, you can run around and stuff and he's trying to attack you. But the fact that they added a cutscene makes him an absolute legend. Oh my god, that's so funny. I am... <laughs> oh no! Oh god, I love it. I, I, okay, I can now be not as upset about the one frame input. And, and he's got the security key. Yeah, wait a minute. No, now that I think about it for a little bit. Now that I'm thinking about it, was there always four? I thought it was always three. Because that guy was optional. You didn't have to come down here. Oh my god. Again, I could be wrong. I don't, I like, oh, the room's locked. Okay, that makes sense. But yeah, like, wow, that is actually just... <laughs> I'm never gonna get over that. That's the highlight of this video. <laughs> Watching a goddamn ex not taking a shower. <laughs> I wonder what those guys do look like underneath that suit. Are they just normal people? Crammed into itty bitty suits? Well, we shall never know. Alright, there we go. Door open. Might be behind that door. Maybe. You never know. Ah, oh, another asshole. All right, we're at this part of the game already, which is actually near the end of the, um... It's near the end of this dungeon, or, like, you know, the x Not Fortress. I've been at this for a little bit, but that's okay. Because it's only because I know what I'm doing, that's why. Oh, wow, this is good. So, in the original, when you were in the background, you still ended up... S oh, god damn it. 
I'm bad, don't mind me. Um, in the original, you still saw the foreground when you were back there. Because, you know, that makes the most sense, right? But, like, now you don't because there's actually... Because, like, you could get confused and stuff, right? So that's... I love all these quality of lives. Like I said, I... I I have to apologize for the rant I did in the other part. I don't know if it was last part or the part before because I haven't gotten to editing yet. But what I can say is I am sorry for it because I am still upset about the fact that it's a one frame input. But to get so mad over something like that when there's so much quality of life just makes absolutely no sense. You know, it just means don't use power bounce. That's it. That's all that there is to it. Or rather, you can use power bounce. You just have to get lucky if you want to make, make it past four hits. Oh, what? I'm really... Screw this mushroom. Actually, I could use it. Why not? Thank you. I didn't know it was full on items. But yeah, like I'm just gonna say sorry. I am still upset about it, but I would have to say that this is a absolutely, like, for now, 10 out of 10 game. I don't think they messed up the end. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. But making it this far in the game, I love it. I might even give it another replay off camera. Like, as in, like, by myself on the good TV. <laughs> I'm trying to remember where to go from here. Because I got two paths, as you can see. Get okay, made it back. Save blocks up here. I thought it was supposed to be down there. Is it really up here? Yeah, it is. It's literally right there. I don't see... Huh. Well, I'm going to call it a part here. This recording is too long for its own good because I'm an idiot and I have to cut a lot of stuff. So I didn't know where I was going to leave off, but whatever. So I'm going to call it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And hit all the buttons that help me, please, and thank you. And be sure to take care of yourselves, alright?